This is Amit Goswami, quantum physicist, conscious researcher, and a quantum activist. I want to invite you to a very unique workshop, 10 days in Jaipur, India, in the middle of a very wonderful city. This is under the auspices of quantum activism Vishalayam and the University of Technology. What we are doing is we are giving a 10-day program for our students, masters and PhD. However, we also want this to be open for anyone who wants just to attend the workshop and not take it as a course. Some students showed interest and this is why we are now opening this up. We have about 10 seats left. We are opening this up for everyone who wants to come. So let me tell you what's in it and what it's for. It is about consciousness. It's about the quantum worldview. You may very well know me. I am one of the founders, uh, exponents of the uh, quantum worldview. And um, Dalai Lama has said, no model of reality can be built without quantum physics in it. And this is what we are teaching. The model of reality based on quantum physics and the door it opens for consciousness. But you will get uh, three, really three workshops in the 10 days. The first one will be about the science of experience. And that will include every experience that you have ever had and some more that you haven't had. Transformational experience, experience of Samadhi. But we won't just talk about it because we are not interested at this university about talking about things. We are interested in working our talk. So we'll teach you how to creatively explore these states of consciousness, this wonderful experience. So that's the first three days. And then we'll get into real science, neuroscience, all the brain stuff. But again, the objective is not to just study different parts of the brain and what their function is and their explanation. Yes, we'll do that. But our real objective is to teach you how to understand the brain, how to reward the brain for creativity and creative enterprises, and most importantly, how to optimize your brain. For example, how can we love? Can we make the brain in such a way that it's more capable of loving, like unconditional love? instead of just romance, instead of just maternity. That is the kind of thing that we teach. And the last four days we'll spend on making a cons consulted study of the creative process and creativity. And you will really, really learn about creative flow, how to engage creativity, the process so very well that when you go home, you will feel like you have really learned something new that you can apply in your life. We'll teach creativity involving thinking. We'll teach creativity also involving feeling. This is something completely new. Something completely new because we have discovered some ingredients about the chakras and how we experience feelings that you won't hear about anywhere else because nobody else knows about these things. So this is the objective of the workshop. I hope you are impressed. I hope you will come and you will find you are sitting among a family consisting of master students, PhD students, who people who are doing this course for certification. And if you want to join any of these groups afterwards, you will also be very welcome. Come, I'll be looking for you.